going on guys Kamek here and this is my first ever black ops 2 commentary and i'm so fucking stoked to have this game played it late 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 into the night last night probably around 4 35 a.m i got off just because i had the one class this morning and let me tell you it was a bitch to get up at nine o'clock and go to my math class and i was falling asleep and quite noticeably i was not the only person that um apparently had come down with the yearly seasonal cod flu and uh, was a little bit drowsy in class, but that's to be expected. So what are we looking at? What are we seeing in the gameplay department today? Well, this is actually a 76 and 5 gameplay that I had last night, and it is fucking sick. And uh, I want to talk a little bit about the kill streaks that are used in this gameplay. As you see here, it is in theater mode because I wasn't recording at the time. But blah blah blah. So what I'm actually using today for kill streaks is the lightning strike, stealth helicopter and Vistol well, uh, Vistol like chopper gunner thing I'm not sure what it's called but Vistol something uh, airship or something like gunship it's fucking awesome and you'll see later on in this game that it just tears through people when I get it and I think I get two of them in one life and it's pretty crazy and uh, as far as uh, game types go kill confirmed has always been my favorite since Modern Warfare 3 and I love 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 that they implemented or implemented the you know the point streak system a little different so tags are worth way way more than a kill it's worth two kills just picking up a, an enemy tag and that can go towards your kill streaks so getting tags and, and you know picking up your own team's tags really 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 goes to show that uh, they Treyarch really wanted to uh, you know make this game way more um, objective based and I think they did a really good job of that I, I've I've seen myself going more for tags than I ever did in Modern Warfare 3 I used to get kills and just let them go and let them stack up kills but not in Black Ops 2 I run out there and try and get the tags as much as possible because it's worth two kills and you see here the lightning strike lightning strike is probably one of my favorite new kill streaks it it's pretty awesome I usually get two to three people with it if you know what you're doing and it's just totally awesome and the stealth helicopter also um, not, a lot of people, not a lot of people right now are running, you know, stingers or whatever, you know, anti-air. So uh, it stays up in the air for quite some time, and it just picks people off, picks people off, a couple at a time, a couple at a time, and it gets me to my next kill streaks. So I would highly recommend using this setup of kill streaks at the time being. I'm sure people, more people are going to start running, uh, you know, anti-air secondaries as they get them unlocked, as the game progresses a little bit. But as of right now, I feel this is the best combination to. You know, throw up a 90 kill game or something like that, something crazy, something crazy ratio like this game is. But uh, some first impressions of this game, I am loving this game. But as you see here, my stealth chopper is just going to town on these kids. And uh, could not be more pleased with this game as of right now. Uh, everything seems to be pretty well balanced. I haven't come across anything that's like overpowered yet. Although I'm sure something will come up, some combination of you know perks and guns will come up. It always does in a Call of Duty game. But uh, for the first couple of weeks, at least, you know, none of that. We don't have to worry about any of that. But like, you do this, this chopper just does work. I think it gets me like seven kills, and um, a couple of teammates pick up the tags. That's points towards your kill streak. So uh, it all adds up. It all adds up. And you see, I got my V stole uh, gunner there, and I go for the double knife. The shit's getting crazy. I just stacking kill streaks on kill, kill streaks here, and uh, shit's popping off. So yeah, I want to show you guys this V stole though. It is going to be sick nasty. If you have never seen one before, it is pretty ballin'. Uh, it's just like a chopper gunner from Modern Warfare 2. I compared it a lot to that. Um, it's just like that. Uh, and uh, the damage on it is just, just great with the splash damage. You can, t you can just sit and spawn with it and just kill people as they spawn. You'll see coming up here, I, I just get people coming out of the spawn. I'm killing them as they spawn. They get about two seconds of spawn uh, protection, and then I just chop them in half with this thing. It is pretty deadly. Definitely one of my favorite new kill streaks, also. And I'm pretty, pretty stoked when I get one of these. I don't get them very often. I only had a few of them last night. Just wanted to get this video up to show you guys this. But like I said, it is, it is just deadly when you get the spawn trap like this going. And the thing is, if your teammates run over and gather all these tags, you can get to your next level of kill streaks all over again without even getting another kill. You see here, I get to my chopper. Just because my team is picking up those tags from those kills I was getting, they run over there and pick up four or five tags. Boom! I'm right to my next kill streak. That gets me to my helicopter. That gets another three, four, five kills because no one's shooting it down. Right back to my V stole and uh, right back to raping face with these kids, and they just don't know what happened. And uh, 
pretty awesome. You see that I pick up my, my second V-Stool right there. Pretty epic. Uh, this gameplay was probably the best gameplay I had all night. Pretty epic, like I said. Uh, cannot say enough about this game. Uh, seems to be more of an SMG type game so far, at least. You see here I'm using the MP7. Silenced with the laser sight. That seems to be one of my favorite setups. I think I'm going to call in my second V-Stool here pretty quick. Uh, it's going to be effing crazy. So if you guys could leave me a like for showing these kill streaks and getting this crazy game, staying up until 5 a.m. for you guys to get gameplays, that would be very much appreciated. And um, as always, guys, take it easy. I'm going to let this gameplay roll out. And uh, you guys can check out the second V-Stool Gunner. And I'm going to let the gameplay roll out by itself with no commentary. It's almost over. But if you guys could leave me a like, it would be very much appreciated. And uh, if you guys are new around here, guys, can feel free to subscribe for all the latest Black Ops 2 and Halo 4 content coming your way. It's going to be a crazy amount of videos will be coming out in the next couple of days, in the coming weeks. So, uh, you know, like I said, subscribe for that. There's going to be plenty of gameplays like this and better. So uh, that's it, guys. Have a good one. Game the fuck on. Until next time, peace out. All right, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Like I said, if you guys could leave me a like or a comment and subscribe, that'd be great. Or you can check out the link on the screen for a gameplay of the Swarm kill streak, which is the biggest kill streak in Black Ops 2. It's absolutely batshit crazy. So go check that out and uh, have a good day, guys. Game the fuck on. Until next time, peace out.